Hey guys, what's going on today? It is Jacob here. I hope you guys are having an absolutely wonderful day. And I certainly am as well for you guys. Um, excuse me. Um, today is basically... I'm going to be doing another video game review of you guys. I was requested to do this a couple of weeks ago by a, a couple of people in, who have commented on a few of my videos. As I recently got the Wii U. As you know, if you haven't checked my unboxing of the Wii U uh, Mario Kart 8 edition, guys, please go check that out. Um, basically, some people request me to do a Mario Kart 8 review, so that's what I'm going to be doing for you today. So let's just show you the case for a, a, a real second, in a minute. So there's the front, and there's the back. Now you're probably thinking, why is it all in different languages it's because the top is obviously British American and then all the rest are like French German Italian Polish Russian whatever whatever they are and basically I was a bit confused about that as well but then you know now Mario Kart 8 as a whole is actually pretty decent I didn't even I didn't even realize it had that little thing in there, but anyway, but um, <clears throat> I'll just quickly show you the inside of the case. We have the Nintendo Shop, no, sorry, Nintendo Shop thing there. I've already used the code, so that's why I've turned it upside down in case any of you guys were trying to put it in. You've just seen what that is, and then we've got a little manual at the back, and then there's the disc. Now the game is decent for a Mario Kart game. It so it store well no not story single player races are actually pretty deep. They have actually updated the CPU on this, so actually uh, you can even though what I'm trying to say is on single player um, CPU can win first place, can't they? But yeah, but you still most likely are going to take over. On this, they've put it so you can like you can get hit back, and then it takes quite a while to get back up. But um, yeah, I really enjoy what they've done with that. It makes it a whole lot more competitive. Um, it gets my competitive of gaming out, <laughs> I suppose you could say. Um, I don't like many of the new characters that they've added. Um, so, for example. If I just well, the majority of the new characters that have come out are basically Cooper characters. Now, don't get me wrong, I like Cooper, but I don't like how with this one they've like put um, an extra eight Cooper characters in the game. Maybe one or two would have been fine, but eight really. Um, not many people use them online. Most people, you, well, what I have seen, not many people use them. Don't get me wrong, they're good characters, but I think they went a bit over the over the top with what they could have put. I mean, they had so many decent character ideas that they were going to put in, and then they just decided to replace most of the original character designs that they were going to put in with just Cooper characters. Now, I suppose that is okay, in the sense that nobody really knew what the uh, Cooper characters looked like, unless you watched the old um, Mario show, whatever, because it's got some of them in that. But apart from that, I don't really understand why they've done that, to be honest. Um, I'm going to try, basically, if you guys have a Wii U, please, um, well... Add me on Nintendo I, uh, Network. My Nintendo Network ID is Mr. Happy Dorito. I haven't. I've had that since I had my 2DS. Like, because it, I registered one of my really old emails with that account, and it had Mr. Happy Dorito come up. So I was like, oh, do you know what? Just keep that. So if you guys do have a Wii U, then please don't. Please don't like. You can just ask me, or I'll add you, and you post your whatever in the comments, and I'll do. It. I'll add you. When I'm next to my Wii U, I play on my Wii U about two times a week, mainly because I'm not—I don't really have many friends on the Wii U yet. 
Um, most of my friends are on actually, or they're on Xbox, so, and that is why I mostly play. But like, anyway, now let's get to the online side of Mario Kart 8. Um, it takes well for me personally. It it's great than it's be, It's been better than any other Mario Kart online. I hated Mario Kart Wii online because I can't get used to the Wii motion controller. Because that's also what you can use. You can actually use the Wii remotes. I had a couple of mates around the other day, and we were taking it in turns. One was using the Wii U gamepad, and the other one was using the Wii U, the Wii controller. And the person who was using the Wii controller just hated it because, you know, it's all like you're actually staring at yourself, and it's I'm not used to that at all. I'm used to the whole thing of holding, picking up a controller, a joystick, whatever, and just playing from there. But again, I'm supposed to sort of tried to do what they did with Mario Kart Wii I suppose but I don't know it wasn't the greatest idea but still I suppose they just wanted to do it just to carry on with the sort of aspect that they did it for Mario Kart Wii so we'll just put that um, option in in case of people do want to use the Wii motion controller I suppose um, what else the courses are actually really good on this, they're really well designed, um, especially online it's really competitive between a lot of people. Um, they've actually got DLC out for this now. Um, they've actually got, if I quickly just load up Google, because I, I know what, I can't remember who the character is, well actually I know who one of the characters is, one of them is Link. So I know who that is. Um, I'm just trying to find, um, hang on, Mario Kart 8, characters, DLC, yeah, um, at the moment there is six multi uh, DLC characters for Mario Kart 8, and that is Mario in the raccoon outfit, it's Peach in, I don't even know what outfit that is, it's Link, we've got the villager from Animal Crossing, um, I don't know who that one is. Oh, it's Pe oh, it's Peach in a cat outfit. Princess Peach in a cat outfit. Not not the greatest thing, but I suppose anyway. It was, it's just a costume, so I can't really complain about that too much. Um, Isabel, who is also from Animal Crossing, I believe. Um, there's also. I don't know his name, but he was in Mario Kart Wii. He's like Bowser. I think he's called Dry Bowser. I think that's what his name is. Um, hang on. Yeah, Dry Bowser. That's it. Um, and yeah, that's basically who the DLC characters are. Um, I don't think they're too bad. Like, I'm not going to purchase the DLC for this game, though, because I don't really see the point. Um, my favourite character, the character I use mostly online is probably uh, Shy Guy, or um, Lenny, or Le Lemmy, whatever his name is. Um, just because they're actually pretty decent characters to use. I do use Toad quite a bit. I use Mario, obviously. Um, I don't use Bowser or Donkey Kong. I've used Waluigi. He's alright. I haven't used Peach or Daisy. Um, and I haven't used Baby Luigi yet, which is a bit weird because I used to love playing as Baby Luigi and Baby Mario and Mario Kart Double Dash. Um, but yeah, anyway. It, yeah, um, basically, I think overall the game is really good. It's just, again, it has a few problems with the multiplayer in terms of lag and everything. Especially, I don't know if anyone else has experienced this, but when a, when a race loads, it normally starts. But recently, every time I have gone into a race, most people have loaded in. And I'm still loading in by the time the race has started. And sometimes I've loaded in so late that the race has started without me. So, like, I don't know if it's my internet. My internet's usually pretty good. And if it was, it would disconnect me anyway from the internet itself. So I don't know what's going on there. Um, but apart from that, guys, the game is really good, and I really do recommend you getting it. Um, 
So yeah guys, that is it for today's video. If you do if you did like this video, please do not forget to leave me a like or thumbs up as I usually say. As it is highly appreciated guys. Um I would also like to give a shout out in today's video. Um now this guy commented on my recent video and he goes by the name he goes by the name of the gaming lion he is an awesome youtuber i mean he's commented on a few of my videos like he's at in his next video he's actually giving me a shout out so i thought i'd give him a shout out before he does his video but in, but yeah guys go over there give him some support he does some really good videos and um just say jake sent you and just tell him i say hi <laughs> really basically but yeah guys again if you enjoyed that please do not forget to leave me a thumbs up as it is highly appreciated um, again if you do have a Nintendo uh, Wii U add my Nintendo ID it is Mr Happy Dorito or post yours in the comments below and I will get I will get on to adding you as soon as, I, as soon as I can and if you do have Mario Kart 8 we will play some Mario Kart 8 together so yeah guys I will see you guys in the next video which will be in a couple of days because I'm going to be busy until um, Friday, so it's most likely I'll be I'll be making a video on Friday. But yeah, again, the guys have a wonderful day, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Have a wonderful day, and thank you for watching.